It's a Sunday night in Jacksonville, Alabama. Gary Sinise's Lieutenant Dan Band is putting on a show this town won't soon forget. The night is about thanking and honoring a hometown veteran. I don't want it to be all about me. I want it to be a, a fun experience for everyone. Everyone seems to agree. Marine Sergeant Ben Tomlinson is no average veteran. Well, I want to introduce you to somebody who loved America so much. He joined the Marines. If I can be an inspiration to someone else, you know, that's a, that's a pretty cool thing. Tomlinson entered the military as a reconnaissance Marine, attracted to the tough training and elite status. During a mission in Afghanistan in 2010, Tomlinson's life changed while working rooftop security. It took me just a few seconds just to realize that I'd been shot. Tomlinson took a bullet through his neck. It traveled around his spine into his chest and came out his shoulder. A punctured lung left Tomlinson struggling for air. When we got to Ben, he, was, he wasn't looking good. He was already blue, blue lips, pulling at his gear, telling us he can't breathe, couldn't breathe. I saw him just closing his eyes and just kind of stop breathing. Just a giant, <sighs> and I was like, okay, good, we got him back. It was a pretty heroic thing that they did. And all my life, I wouldn't be here right now if it wasn't for those guys. A rescue chopper took him to safety. The injury left Tomlinson unable to walk, and a hometown hailing him as a hero. It couldn't have to be from a, from a place that has uh, so much heart, shows so much support for uh, you know one of their own guys just because you know, I ran into some misfortunes. Tomlinson found fortune when he called Veterans United, asking about how to use his VA home loan benefit. Loan specialist Matt Etling answered the call and recognized the chance to go above and beyond. After speaking with him and researching his story, I thought that if I contacted Veterans United Foundation, we would be able to impact his life quite a bit more that way. Unbelievable. I mean, it's a... Uh... It's one of those things uh, I think God was in it. Veterans United Foundation partnered with Tunnel to Towers and the Gary Sinise Foundation to donate $200,000 to ensure Tomlinson didn't just get a home, but a specially equipped smart home. I'll promise this to you, we are going to build you a house that you deserve, the sacrifice that you made for your country. See, the Lieutenant Dan Band wasn't just putting on a show. Why are we here today? It came to Alabama to help make a dream come true for one of America's heroes. There's a lot of wounded out there, very severely wounded, that have special challenges, uh, especially with their independence, and that's what these homes do. So we need great partners that are willing to see what we're doing and just want to come in and help, and that's what Veterans United did. There's a few special groups out there that um, are all about the guys they're helping, not about themselves. And uh, the guys that are putting on my concert and uh, Veterans United are definitely a couple of those. People who understand heroes rock and roll among us. These guys have given so much, you know, and the fact that there are people out there that recognize it and want to do stuff to help them just is so amazing to me. For Veterans United Foundation, I'm Eric Blumberg.